Hey, how's everybody doing? Welcome back to Ask Podcast on YouTube. We've got Blue Rays this time. I'm going to do it's kind of a genre thing. And this is just something that, and it's kind of amazing. I was talking to a buddy of mine the other night. And we're, I was talking about, you know, he's talking about, he does a lot of work on his blog and stuff. I was saying, he's asking about videos. I'm like, well, I'm working on one. I got it's going to be, you know, 80s and 90s teen sex comedies, basically. He's like, oh, okay, which ones? I was like, well, I'm going to do this one, this one, this one. He's like, I've never seen any one of those. It surprised me. So that's why I want comments. At the end of this, you know, if you watch the whole thing, comment the end, you know, tell me if you've seen all three of these. I got a feeling that a good chunk of y'all seen at least two or three of these. So let's get started. Teen sex comments. I think I got them in order. Motherfucking porkies. Oh my God, when this movie came out, this where did this movie spread across the playground? Um, I can remember being in... First or third grade? Probably, well, no, it had to be the same. I'm trying to calculate majors. Third grade. My parents, I don't know. My mom, I don't know where she was. She was not working at the time. My dad was at work. I got home early from, I got home from school. She was not home. And they had rented movies. Like, the day before. And I remember they'd rented me, like, some Charlie Brown thing or something. I went to go put the tape in, and I grabbed the wrong tape and put in Porky's. And sat there and watched all the Porky's. First time I saw it, I was young. Real simple. It's uh, back in the, what, the 50s, 60s, probably, probably the 50s. Angel Beach, Florida. These guys wanted to get laid. The girlfriends ain't wanted to give it up. So they said, they're going to go to the local horse. And they'll, oh, I'll call Porky's. It's this, uh, kind of like a houseboat out in the Florida Everglades. They go down there. Porky fucks them over, steals their money, says they're going to get revenge on Porky. Best known for the scene that's on the cover here, the shower scene, where they you find out that the guys have realized that the girls' gym showers, they have their own peepholes. So they go, and they're peeping on them, and there's a scene where one guy sticks his dick through the hole. And, yeah, he just goes around. This movie is fucking hilarious. I love it. Blu-ray's great. Ain't many extras. There's, like, a commentary. Porky's through the peephole. A featurette. Two featurettes, TV spots, original theatrical trailer. Fairly cheap. Um, let's say, and the next, like a week after we rented it, I don't know how we, ended, my dad ended up having a copy of Porky's. And like the next time my parents went anywhere, my friend left me there by myself. I was probably about nine or ten by then. All my buddies came over to watch Porky's. Like, because there was one like at school, we're hearing all about this movie from our friends that had cable. Because the little elementary school I went to, it's kind of like divided in half. If you lived in one area, like the east side from the school, there was no cable. So one cable was antenna, you know, stuff like that. But if you lived on the west, the, where the school was or the west side, cable. You know, all these people seen this fucking movie on HBO, so we're all hearing about it. So everybody came and watched it. Once I charged two bucks to get into it. <laughs> Fucking Porky. Great funny film. Kick ass Blu ray. Fairly, like I said, fairly cheap, fairly easy to find. Uh, Porky's 2. And there's Porky's 3. Uh, Porky's 2, the next day, and Porky's Revenge. That's the third one. They're okay. Uh, I think they're all I'm looking at. Then the next one, the number one would be Fast Sounds of Rich My High, which is the DVD Blu ray, of course. Really, I mean, everybody knows this fucking movie pretty much. Infamous for the Phoebe Kate scene. Matter of fact, my buddy that I was talking to that had not seen these, he goes, Yeah, I've seen that scene. I was like, What, y'all? Uh, you know, Sean Penn, Phoebe Cage, Jennifer Jason Lee, Judge Reinhold, based on the book, which I'd love to find. I don't know why that book is out of print. I've never figured out why it's not only out, it's much to me as there for. Remember, so it follows like basically a year in the life of these high school students. Really well done. So many young actors in their first, young yeah, actors actually the first thing they really did, the first big thing. Love the fuck out of this movie. Blu-ray looks nice. Um, pretty much has just all the extras of the uh, DVD. The old DVD's got director's commentary trailer. I don't think there is some cut scenes because there's some scenes that are only in the TV version. I don't think any of them are on this. Then the modern one because that's that's about eighty. Those are like eighty-two through about eighty-five. The modern equivalent. Pretty much American Pie. This is what late late nineties ninety. Eight ninety nine. Fucking and it's the same thing. You know, a lot of casts where they came really big. Allison Hannigan, Natasha Leone, you know, Sean. Oh 
I can't think of his name now. Shit. Shannon Elizabeth, that dude, that dude, that alien looking girl, Tara Reed, the pie fucker. And this, this one, it was huge. This is the one where most people know they're under 30. This is the one they know with these three. DVD Blu ray. And extras, not all, deleted scenes, outtakes, audio commentary, cast and crew, cast and taste, spotlight and location from the set, photographic montage with director and producer comments, poster concepts, 100 Years of Universal, and more. Uh, I mean, every one of these has the same basic plot. It's especially like these, the Porkies and a bunch of horny high, high school kids trying to get laid. And this one, yeah, they're trying to make sure Pee Wee gets laid for to get out of high school. And this one, all the gangs trying to lose their virginity before prom. Funny ass little films. I don't see, you don't see this kind of shit getting made again. Like, these go in spells. Like, in the 90s, there wasn't none of this. Especially not release the theater big. And then American Pie came out and was huge, huge. And they've made piles of those. There's, you know, what? American Pie 1, 2. Yeah. First one, second one, American Wedding, Union Four, and then there's like four or five directed video ones. There's like eight of those movies now. And I can get out. I got a set that's all the directed, all of them, except for probably, maybe Reunion ain't on there. Cause Reunion's the newest one. I've got that something. I've, I've got all of them in some kind of format, DVD or Blu-ray. I need to do a video on that one time. But anybody, else, you know, what's some other ones from this genre, the teen sex comedy genre, y'all like? There's so many screwballs. There's you know, oh, there's all kinds of these. All the bikini films. That's what the '90s was. The '90s was the bikini films, and those you know you saw them on cable. You didn't catch you know those didn't play theaters. All this shit played theaters. So I rambled enough. Talk to everybody later. Bye bye.